Hey everybody, this is Carl Brown here from GuitarLessons365.com and today we're going to finish up our look at using modal target notes with pentatonic scales. Uh, today we're going to focus on the minor modes. Um, so we're going to base all this off of the minor pentatonic scale. So if you look at the PDF that you can get, if you look in the lessons, uh, the description, um, you'll see the uh, PDF you can download. So make sure you grab that and it's going to be a lot easier to follow along if you do. So we're going to start here. We're going to be using the minor pentatonic scale. So if you want a minor sound, you can just use minor pentatonic sound, uh, scale. But say you wanted a Dorian sound. We're going to add one target note. Well, for Dorian, it'll be a major sixth. It's the only mode that has a major sixth with a uh, minor third in it. Um, and then for Phrygian, we're going to add the flat second. So those are going to be the two minor based modes that we're going to add to the Aeolian, or, or really a, a minor is what you're going to be using, A minor pentatonic. So uh, let's start taking a look here. If you look at the chart, you have uh, the basic A minor. All right, so the white circles are the root notes. So that's going to be A. So if you want A Dorian, all you have to do is add the target notes that say D, the square the white squares with a D in them. So we have All right, pretty simple stuff, you know. It's just you you're adding that F sharp in there. Um, so there's two of them in there. So now we have three Phrygian root notes that are all going to be a B flat. So there's going to be one here at the sixth fret here on the low E, eighth fret on the D, and then sixth fret on the high E. So we have our normal scale. And then add the Phrygian root. That's a really good scale to use if you're trying to get a snake dance inside a hat or something. So uh, this minor pentatonic shape too, we're going to do the same process here. So we have the actual scale shape itself. The minor root notes are now going to be on the D string, 7th fret, and the 10th fret on the B string. You notice I'm, I keep letting the A ring out since we're doing all this in A so you can hear what the sound of the scales are over this, um, are over like a, a harmonic foundation. So we have now uh, the Dorian target note here at the 7th fret on the B string and the 9th fret on the A. Let's make it Phrygian. So instead of the Dory root notes, we have those two Phrygians. Always a half step up from the um, uh, the the root note. So. All right. So we can try some stuff up with that. Anybody ever wanted to know what is that the scale they're using in wherever I may roam, roam from Metallica? I think we just found it. All right, so minor pentatonic shape three, same process. Uh, here's the actual scale shape. By the way, you can play these, finger these any way you want. I, I usually I like to use my pinky a lot, so I know a lot of people don't. So just do whatever feels comfortable. So we have the minor root note for that scale shape. 
is going to be the pinky at the 12th fret or the 10th fret on the B. All right, and then the scale, if we're going to add the Dorian root note, that F sharp is right here at the 5th fret, I'm sorry, 5th string, 9th fret, then 11th fret on the G string. So we have... And then the Phrygian. It's just amazing how much different both of those scales sound um, compared back to back when you just you change one note in it. All right, so we have minor pentatonic shape four. It's based off of this pentatonic shape. All right, we're keeping all these in A, so we're just going up, but obviously you're gonna wanna play these in any keys. They're just movable. So this first scale, and you had the, well, you can move it to, you know, D minor. Same shape, and the, and the target notes are in the same spots. All right, so let's take a look here. We have a, um, a uh, the uh, Dorian target notes here at the 14th fret, the F sharp there, the F sharp at the 11th fret on the G string, and then the 14th fret on the high E. All right. And then the Phrygian root notes will have the B flat here at the 13th fret, and then the B flat at the 15th fret on the G string. All right, and the final pentatonic shape for minor. We have, by the way, I'm expecting you guys to be following along with the tab. I know I'm kind of flying through these scale shapes, but just showing you what you can do with it. The tab was right in front of you. So we have now, we have the 14th fret, the Dorian root note there on the low E, 16th on the D, and 14th back on the high E. So we have this. All right, and the Phrygian. We're just gonna be adding right above the A. All right, so let's work on that. So have fun with this stuff that you know these modal target notes are just quick ways of getting modal sounds um, using major major type modes or minor type modes um, and now we've kind of just taken it all over the neck with all the scale forms so I hope you guys got a lot out of this and, and can add these notes to your basic pentatonic phrases that you've been playing probably for years and it can really kind of spice up the sound a little bit all right I'll see you guys soon bye bye